What are the odds that you had perfect sunny days for the past few weeks and only on the days you live for a trip, it starts to rain? But you know what? Rain can't stop us. We're gonna make the best out of this trip. In this video, we're taking you cuties to Andong, a vibrant culture city with so much history and tradition. If you cuties want to experience an authentic Korean tradition during your trip, this is a city you must visit. I'm so glad we got to experience this new part of Korea that we never thought it existed. At the end of this trip, we were again in awe of how beautiful Korea is and so proud to call this country our home. Our first stop was this village called Andong Shinsedong Mural Village. It's a quiet residential area where you can see murals in every alley. Along the way, we also spotted cute sculptures and installations. Since we were here during cherry blossom season, we got to fully enjoy the beautiful pink trees. And I have to say, the rain totally made this village more charming and magical. It's always amazing to see how art is incorporated into daily life in some villages like this one. And our goal in this video is to make you cuties fall in love with Andong. So get ready to take notes cuties, we're about to show you the best two days itinerary in Andong. This is what happens when you're single for over decades. What do you think of Andong sis? It's so beautiful. beautiful. Even though it's rainy day, it is so beautiful. We're yeah. actually really worried that it's rainy. Yeah. But actually, the fact that it's rainy makes this place more cinematic. The cafe was so right up our alley, sis. What was that Hanok, the Korean traditional the the vibe? Space, the vibe yeah. and everything. Oh my goodness. That was so beautiful. Yes. I loved it. It was beautiful. Lovely. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're hungry. We're super famished right now, cuties. Yeah, very, very famished. So I found this place called Okjong Mill. They have things like Kudungo Bogo. So I guess so instead fish, of patty, a beef patty, they put a Kudungo. <laughs> okay. You never know unless you try it. Yeah. So, okay, let's give it a yeah. go. So we are arrived cuties, but apparently it's closed. I really wanted to try the fish burger. Oh well. So my sister is currently finding another restaurant for us to eat. So hungry. Yeah, what should we have? Ooh, pizza! Margarita. Pizza. Ooh, wings! Dude, this place is actually well known for their beer section. They're known for the Andong Labber. <laughs> oh my goodness, they look so delicious. Oh my god, they smell so good. So when was the last time we had a wing? Mm. 
stop reacting right now. Who Whoa, my goodness. <gasps> this is sourdough, sis. We arrived! Oh wow. my goodness, this, this is crazy. Yeah, this is legit Korean traditional home. Yeah. Even like the doorknob, the door lock, even the living room area yes. is like. We'll show you this yeah. tomorrow morning. Right now it's pitch dark. Yeah. So this place is a Korean traditional resort called Kurume. Every place has a little different structure. Uh -huh. This one, um, I think it was around Ishimon. And it price. includes um breakfast. So yeah. So tomorrow we're gonna have breakfast at 8 a.m. in the morning. Yes. So yeah. But they definitely renovated the bathroom. Yeah. Right. The bathroom is definitely modernized. Yeah. Cause if it's not modernized, <laughs> the is not stay here. <laughs> I got a like this, okay? I can't do this. <laughs> like, you can see all my little <laughs> shit. Okay? Well, if you cuties really want to experience a Korean traditional house, this, this is the place. Come to Andong cuties. Yes. What do you think of here, sis? This place is so beautiful. Yesterday it rained a lot, mm -hmm. so we're a little bit afraid that there won't be any cherry blossoms. Yeah. But look at this. Look at this.
Look at this. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Oh my god. I have never seen this much pile of cherry blossom on the floor. Oh, what is she doing? Sister, that's actually kind of dirty. <gasps> wow. Oh my god. Whoa. 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 <laughs> okay. What are you doing? <laughs> One day, there will be a dream planted in your heart that seems beyond your capacity to hold, beyond your ability to manifest. That is when the journey of your life will begin, the journey into trust, into surrender, into releasing the old and embracing the new. I hope you'll begin to see the space between where you are and where you want to be not as one of lack or impossibility, but as an opportunity to gently build the person you want to be into form. Realizing at last that what we are asking life to give us is what life is waiting for us to give it. When we want love, our task is to be more loving. When we want change, our task is to be more daring. When we want progress, our task is to be more organized. When we want awe, our task is to be more grateful. Ooh, it's very dense. Yeah, there's like a... Mm, and there's a bit of chestnut inside. Mm. What is inside? Is it apple? Or chestnut? Oh, it's apple. Mm. Definitely apple. Like sweet on top of sweet. Andong Hawe Village is one of the most famous folk village in Korea that is designated as a UNESCO World Heritage. This village is not only a tourist attraction, but is still home to many modern day people. You can easily spend an hour slow walking and admiring the nature that harmonizes with the traditional houses. It's such a stunning village and we were astonished at how so many houses are still well preserved. A nicely paved aisle will lead to many beautiful houses and walls made with bricks and mud. And you can easily take a glimpse inside the beautiful gardens and folk and modern tools hanging here and there. But what we were most looking forward to seeing was this great silvoka tree which is over 600 years old and is the highest tree in the village. 
Situated at the very center of Hawaii Village, this tree is called Samshindang, which means Shrine for Three Gods, and is worshipped as a village spirit. You could write a wish on a piece of white paper and tie them around the tree. It's such a majestic tree that captivated us for a while. Visiting Andong was definitely a unique experience that left a lasting impression on us. We felt like the city lives in a different time outside of the modern world. The city is definitely a hidden gem that we have found this year, and hopefully, you kitties can also fall in love with this charm.